Yo, yo, what's up everyone? Hope everyone's having a good day. In today's video, we're gonna be opening up and reviewing for the first time. In front of us here, we have two of the brand new 2022 Bowman Baseball Mega Boxes. This was the first time I was able to find any in the wild. I scooped some up at Target. They were $44.99 each, which is a pretty big price markup from last year. Pretty sure they were only $30 last year. In these boxes, we're looking for, we have four 10-card packs of the 2022 Bowman Baseball. And then there's two exclusive five-card Chrome packs as well. If you guys want to take a second to pause, here are all the randomly inserted pack odds of pulling randomly inserted cards they got a pretty good amount of numbered parallels hopefully we're able to pull one of those or a nice auto without any further ado we'll start with this box right here if you haven't already like comment subscribe say a prayer to the card gods we need to pull some bangers i feel like i'm so far behind on uh bowman mega boxes though my target didn't put any out till literally the day, a week after everyone else's. So here are the two regular, or the bonus packs, excuse me. We'll save those for the end, obviously. And you get four, this regular Bowman packs. I wonder if you can pull numbered cards from these. I don't know, we'll find out. Obviously, what you're hoping for is just pull some fire out of the, uh, the bonus bonus packs we have chapman pretty good amount of paper to start it off it looks like we got a paper first anthony rodriguez nico victor we got a bowman chrome dario lopez and a lawler on the back I like lawler it's always nice to pull a nice first though let's go on to pack number two All right, we got Judge, we got a rookie, some paper rookies. Some more paper. We got a Nico Cavadas, Bowman first. And then a Ed Howard, this regular chrome on the back. I remember last year I opened up one of these Bowman baseball mega boxes, pulled a... Uh, what was his name? Jordan Blaze Auto. One of those Mojo Autos. So hopefully we can have that kind of luck again. We got a nice first. Another first. We got a Maki Backstrom. And this card's like sticking to it. Edgar Guerrero on the back. We got two first. Our last pack of regular... Our, re our last regular pack before we move on to our uh, mo mojos. We've got Adele, Alina, Grom, Seeger. We got a rookie, a first. All right. Bello. He actually has looked pretty good lately. And then Alan Serta. A couple more first to end off the regular packs. All right. Now we get into the good stuff. Hopefully we get something nice. First pack, we'll see. Ooh, look how pretty these cards are. We got Makolo uh, Escato, a first. Everson Ortega. Ooh, is that a, oh, I thought it was a purple. It's this uh, rookie of the year insert. Brandon Marsh. Luke, these aren't numbered or anything. Brandon Marsh, Luke Waddell, it's for the Marlins, oh, Brady Allen, these first, are these mojos look disgusting though, big fan of the looks, obviously I'll sleeve up, top load everything after the video, not gonna make it a hour long video sleeving up everything, but alrighty, let's keep it rolling. I thought I saw the Marlins. Was hoping for Cleo Watson. That'd be sick. Alrighty, we got Guerrero again. Peyton Willis or Wilson. Sosa. 
Quintero and Polanco. Not a first. Pretty cool. Pretty sick looking cards. Didn't really pull anything too crazy. I don't know how this isn't a Bowman first. This guy was born in 2004. But, oh well. Still looks real sick. Let's move on to box number two. Box number one really didn't have anything too crazy. That's why we got two boxes. If you guys have opened any of these product or opened any of these boxes yourself, comment below your best pulls. Hopefully someone out there is able to pull a banger. Alright, we'll start with uh kind of do the same, go with the same uh pattern here. Start with the regular pack before moving on to the bonus packs. Hopefully we see some color in this box. We got Yelich, some paper, we got Guzman, Torque, Dominguez, Alvin Guzman. Pretty sure these guys got to be brothers, right? We got Guzman and Marte on the back. Hopefully we can, I want to see some color or some ink. All right, Bellinger, Shet, Chato. We got a Lorenzo, Rodriguez, Bobby Witt, Peyton Wilson again, and a Francisco Alvarez. All right, we got Hoy, Cal, Lopez, Trout, Luis Robert, James Wood. He's one of the top prospects. We'll take even a paper of him. We got Serta, Minier, Luis Gonzalez, some chrome action, and a Casas on the back. It's crazy how young most of these guys are. Born in like 2002. Alrighty, Pete Alonzo. Come on now. They got to start hooking us up a little bit. Joe Ryan. Josiah Gray. Castro. Luis Verdugo. Austin Martin. Triana. Jordan Walker. And CJ Abrams on the back. Alrighty, so it all comes down to this. We only have two more packs of our two bonus packs. Still haven't pulled anything too crazy. I'm feeling this one. This one's got to have a banger in it. It's a nice way to start. Anytime you see a Yankees prospect, Cabrera. Leave that in a moment. Paguero. Perez. Come on now. Luis Gonzalez. And Maximo Acosta. They are not hooking us up with the color or with any autos. Come on now. Luis Gonzalez. All right, our last pack, everybody. Everyone say a pair to the card, guys. We absolutely need it. All right, we got uh, Rafaela. I don't see any color back. Oh, no, I think we got another insert. Dang it. All right, Rafaela. Carlos Aguirre. Mr. No-Hitter himself. Reed Detmers. Not numbered or anything. A Rosemere Quintana. And last, Diego Velasquez. So no autos, no... That was pretty rough couple boxes there. I mean, let's go over all the pulls. Let me know what you guys thought. 
the chrome the mojos they look beautiful we did get some nice first so we're happy about that but that's really you know all that we uh have to be happy about here polanco quintero sosa ton of these mojo chrome first which you gotta be happy about bellow Yeah, so pretty, uh, I mean, it was definitely a fun couple of boxes. We just didn't really pull anything too crazy, but pretty fun couple of boxes. Love Bowman Baseball, and that's going to do it for this review. So if you guys have opened any of these boxes yourself, comment below your best pulls. Hopefully someone out there has been able to pull some heat. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Show some love as always. Like, comment, subscribe, all of that, and peace out.